Okay, hello and welcome to yet another box opening from the Rhystic Buddies YouTube channel. Today we have some nice little goodies, another collector booster box, and a couple promo packs I've gotten from, uh, you know, one of my uh, local LGSs uh, to carry me on the last collector booster box package opening. Then I got a care package from my buddy Steve. He had actually sent me a couple packs I'd like to open, show him some appreciation. So let's get on with it. I'm going to do the promos at the end. And let's get on to this collector booster, see what we can get here. Get a little action going on. Little slice and dice. Excited, still really haven't pulled a lot of the jeweled lotuses, sadly. Only, I think, one in all the boxes, but the Mana Drain and the Vampire Tutor have loved me. Like, crazy amount. I can already feel the Pringling going on. It's crazy. Wizards of the Coast, come on now. Can we do something about this? This is insane. Oh, how bad? Like, you can already... I can feel it in the pack. Like, it's just curling already. It's a little shuffle. Truffle. Just pop that one over there. Alright, cool. Put it over to the side over here. Alright. Let's get to it. Oopsie, a little spillage going on over there. All right, first one. Can we start it off hot? Can we start off hot with that whore? A little fine horn. Ooh, arcane signet. I like that start. Horn in the Evo style. Okay, Kedis. Court action. Ooh, fine. Oh, that looks nice. Necrotic Hex. And Hamza. Ooh, Najila the Blade Blossom. That's a nice hit. One of my favorite commanders. She's actually my first deck build. Might do a deck tech on her. Started with budget from actually the commander's quarters. Got a lot of inspiration from that. And then Sengir Dark Baron. Then I actually it expanded it uh, from that uh, budget build. So I'll separate the etched. Okay, not bad. I do love me some Najila. Can never have too much Najila. Not my plague might disagree, but they're not here right now, thankfully. Ooh, command tower foil. To start off. That looks really nice. Ooh, another command tower. Foil. Foil borderless. Wow. That is pretty crazy. Thought vessel. Extended foil. Wow, the extended's already starting to hot. I'll put you to the side. Ooh, Justice Will. Extended foil. This one's starting to tick up the price. It's been the most popular of the wills. I think still in my mind, a Chroma's will is the best. But that's personal preference there on that one. Jessica does give some much needed things to red and extended soul ring. Nightshade Harvester. Slotty Eye of the Storm. Ooh, another Timna the Weaver. That was slotted nicely into the binder. And then we got a Yurlock, a Scorch Thrash. I actually needed this. I never got an etched one to uh for my mana burn spiky hugs deck. Perfect. I'll keep it into a pile of uh, well mixed up piles. Don't don't worry about that. Some really good reprint slots so far. Their reprint slot has been very nice. Daring Saboteur, do I miss it? Yes. It's face Fetters. It's the first one. Saboteur. Ooh. Vault of Champions Foil. Very nice. Been very happy with this lens so, from this set. Uh, Opal Palace. Dargo. Shipwrecker. 
That's foil's been very nice of us. Who's our reprint? Ibra Shadiki. And again, Arkham Weaver. So I've been getting very lucky on these etched so far. Some really good etch action. Always gonna have more Tim as well. Ooh, Togo. Goblin Weaponsmith. Ooh, a roomie of the Dead Tide. She's been very popular. I'd say I think she's the most popular commander in this set. And she's an uncommon at that. Pretty crazy. Really nice looking Court of Cunning right there. Extended foil. Oopsie. Skipped one. Commander Sphere extended. That over here and a Command Beacon extended. Glossian. My reprint is Ishai Ujitai Dragon Speaker. And uh, close it out. Lysa Shroud of Dusk. Put that over there. Very nice. The Pringling isn't too bad, actually. They're actually staying flat on my table for now, so that's good. Get the zombie token out of here. Feast of Secession, really like that artwork there. Seb McKinnon. Some really good stuff from him in the Magic Universe. Swifu Boots. Ooh, extended. Foil. That is nice. Laboratory Drudge. Fact of Fiction extended. Flamegan Herald. Cascade. Togo. Etched. Brewstar for my reprint and then a Verna. Chaos Bloom. It's pretty nice to me on the extended. Recently those extended arts have been hitting quite a bit. Meteoric Mace. That won me my first actually draft. Some friends of mine. Earlock, once again. Armored Sky Hunter. Flesh Bag. Full Art. Slash the Ranks Full Art. Abomination of Land of War. Etched. Then we got it for a reprint. Kiri Line Slinger. And close it out. Clark the Thumbless. Just faced him in actually a spell table game. Uh, today, and wow, is he cool. The ability to copy spells immediately and then add his thumb into it. Get some really cool interactions from spells that you wouldn't see normally. Even if you just get some green in there, cultivate that you can copy immediately. Now well, that's value, because you can get them out very quickly for two. Preordained foil, okay. Candy Lieutenant. Counterspell. Extended foil. That's nice. That looks gorgeous. Kanji the Sky Warden. Tormont the Desecrator. Dawn Glade Regent. Ooh, three wishes. I do like me some of that. Extended art. Ooh. First non reprint myth drop. Soulfire Eruption. Faith Shadow Cat, my reprint is Ludovic. And then we got some Azara Renegade Recruiter. I really like how these etch just got the two sides, like, you know, red on one side, blue on the other. That is really sharp. To sleep these almost immediately. No big hitters yet. I'm kind of sad. We still have plenty of box left. We're about halfway through, I believe.
Oh my god. That's what I'm talking about. Just as I said it. Oh yeah. That is nice. Look at that. Wow. Just wow. <sighs> Jeweled Lotus. I've been waiting for you, foil. Oh, I need to put that as high a priority and just sleeve that. Oh, Animanonic Deluge. Another mythic. That mythic symbol just looks like it's standing out right there. That is really nice. So that's two of the that set of the uh, kind of deluge set. Sadar Kondo is my reprint to finish off. We'll get the lucky rabbit over here. Wow, Jeweled Lotus and another mythic in the same box. Where's my sleeves? Where did you go? Jeez. There you are. Just wow. Now that's a hit. That is a hit. Can we pull another one from the box? Is that possible? Now that's spicy. That is spicy. Oof! Four left. Now I'm pumped. It just only gets better from here. Man, what a great pull. So glad I did this box opening. It's a little late. My lead game ended up running a little late, but was it worth it? Man. Sarah's here. I really like this card. Such a good sack outlet for one. And you get to scry. Always good for value. Fine horn foil. Extended. Then Zara. Horizon Stone. I want to try using that in my uh, mana burn deck. So you can actually save yourself from uh, losing mana from your lock. Get a little Horizon Stone action. And our skiff extended. Keeper of the Cord, one of my favorite cards from this set. Just so good in white. They really need that, you know, land help. And getting extra creatures when somebody else has more than you is always good against token decks. Arumi Etch. That's really nice. Arumai, Arumi. That's sick. Then we got Kaidel, Chosen a Crufix. And a Sakashima Etch. Oh my god, I was waiting for this too. This has been, what a box, man. I've been waiting for an etched one to start my deck. And I was just about to order one. I'm so glad I didn't. Man, I had one standard one. And this etched one. Oh, man. This cannot do it justice. Man, am I excited. This has been such a good box. Jeez. Three, man. What are we going to get next? A mana drain? Vampiric Tutor? Another Jewel Lotus extended this time? Extended and full? Um... I'm asking for the moon here, but all duly possible. I've seen three jeweled lotuses in one box so far from openings, and that is absolutely insane. I think it was from Bad Boy Gaming. He had opened a box literally titled Best Box Opening Ever, and he's right on that one. Thought Vessel. Always love my mana rocks, especially the foil kind. Keeper of the Cord. Extended foil. Wow, that is sick. What a great... It must have heard me talking about it. Look at that. Extended foil. That's such a good looking card. Man. Man, man, man. Reliquary Tyler. Extended. Play Griever. Okay. Malcolm. Tan of the Blood Weaver. And Nevin Rawl. King of the Discs. To separate uh, jeweled lotus over there. <sighs> Two left, man. That jeweled lotus, so good, so 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 good. Just can't get any better than that. Go extended would get better, but man, pumped to just get that. Ooh, oars of advocates. Okay, another great uncommon card. Strength of the pack. Robrak. Slash the rank foil. Very nice. Preordain extended art. Very nice. Sakashima's will. This will set is very cool. 
control command commander you get to choose both or you just choose one normally for four get control of a creature and each other creature you control becomes a copy of that creature that could be game winning potentially right there or even having like a nyx bloom ancient just get times like 15 mana tap one forest get 15 mana out of it absolutely insane things are possible with that moldrotha what a great commander kadama of the east tree not bad not bad so many etched cards all right last pack give a little magic rub right here oh man see if this bodes as well as the that jeweled lotus pact did mix them up a little bit so let's hope that look paid off supernatural stamina popper favorite open the armory okay never roll early okay war room uh not too excited about that Force charm oh i'm gonna get and blade grift prototype as i believe that's the money slot right there yep that was and Karametra as my reprint that is gorgeous and bell borka reverse that man what a box jewel lotus some really nice hits in there Court of Conan, full extended Jessica's Will. And some great reprints with Timna, as usual. She's been pretty popular with me. I think I've hit one at least per box. I'm going to go with some packs. Susanna Kerr writing back uh, back real quick. Shout out to my buddy Steve. Send this over to me. All right. oh, I forgot they do it weird. They do the land first. Oh, they do it in reverse. So this will actually save us some trouble. Some time. Orin Reef. Ooh, Tangled. Shatter Skull. Blade Dancer. All right. Nothing too crazy left. I forgot they do it in reverse. What a weird way to do the boxes. Throne of Eldraine, pretty sure they do it just like every other box. Ooh. There we go. Nice little throwback to Eldraine over here. Turn the nature is always nice. Dwarven mine. Gingerbread. Ooh, drown on the lock. That is nice. Counter target spell. <laughs> Or a creature destruction. Very nice. Nice little utility card there. Frogify, always a favorite. And Murderous Rider, the showcase. That looks really cool. And just a mountain. Cool, let me get some promo pack action. Sorry, my peck opening skills are not at the expert level. Solemn Simulacrum. With a Land of War Visionary. And a Night Peck Ambusher. A wolf creature that boosts other werewolves. That's interesting. Just makes free wolves. And some little arena action. Oh man, that was terrible. Opening right there. Didn't even try on that one. What's this? Ooh. Castle Lockwain. That looks gorgeous. Draw a card, then lose life equal to the number of cards in your hand. That's nice. Don't think I have that one in the collection. Flourishing Fox. That's cool. Cycling little card right there. This is gorgeous. And Runus Ultimatum. For 
for a nice low cost 7. Destroy everything else the opponents don't control. Kind of like Cyclonic Rift, just very color dependent and uh, with destruction instead of that bounce. That is kind of nice. Not bad, not bad. That's everything we had for today. Uh, appreciate you guys tuning in. If you like the content, please like and subscribe. And just come on. If you subscribe, I'm, I'm pretty sure you'll hit a Jeweled Lotus in your next pack. Like, 50% chance of not a 50% chance. But good luck. Thanks for tuning in. Have a great time, guys.